What is going on, guys? Thanks for tuning in to Wingate Solutions. I hope you're doing well. I'm out in the woods filming a couple of videos for you guys. So I figured I'd bring you a, a product spotlight, something I've been using for a little bit now and I'm really digging. So I figured I'd let you guys know. And that is the ADM, American Defense Manufacturing Harris to Pick Rail Bipod Adapter Quick Release. This thing is amazing. Um, I bought it from shortactionprecision.com. Uh, short I'm sure you can get it other places, but that's just the first place that I saw and had, had it for a decent price. They're not cheap, but for what you get out of this and what you can do to a Harris bipod that you already own and bring it into like, you know, 2024, this thing is amazing. So I run bipods on a lot of my rifles, but I don't like to leave them on all the time. Um, it's more of an add-on depending on what I'm doing. Because I might ne not necessarily want the extra weight or bulk snag hazard always in the front of some of my rifles, especially when I run my SPRs kind of more as a general purpose rifle. If you haven't seen my videos on that stuff, go back and check those out. I get a little bit more in depth with that. But I like to run these rifles as general purpose carbines. So I don't always need to have or want to have a bipod. I also don't live in an area where a bipod is always going to suit me. I have a lot of hills, a lot of rolling hills, micro terrains, things that make shooting off a bipod a little bit cumbersome with exception, right? So there's times I want it, times I don't. And without getting too wordy, that is why I really like the idea of a quick detach. I always just undid the Harris bipod mount from like a swivel stud mount. I always ran on these. I would just undo it by hand because they are toolless. They're just not quick detached to take off normally. But you can take off a Harris bipod mount just by hand. It just takes a minute or a couple seconds and it's just not as smooth as something like this. And I felt like over time I would eventually maybe wear something out on the Harris doing that. So it was time for me to move to a quick detach solution. And this thing is perfect. It really works great. Especially if you already have one of these Harris's and you want to again upgrade it. But just having a pick rail under your gun, or if you already have a quad rail, whatever, you can then take this quick attach mount. If you guys are familiar with ADM scope mounts, really high quality mounts, it works off that exact same lever, has an actual locking tab that you need to depress before opening it. You can also adjust it for tension depending on the tolerances of your pick rail. But this thing is great. All I need to do is get it started up there, pull that lever, and it's locked on. Now I have a bipod on my rifle, like I have it in a pack or just have it off the rifle or if I'm out the range, just want to swap between rifles. It's so much easier than having to buy a ton, ton of bipods or have to deal with again, that less than quick detach of the stock Harris swivel mount or a uh, bipod mount, if that makes sense. So yeah, real quick, but I wanted to show you guys how awesome these ADM Harris bipod mounts are. If you want the ability to quickly attach and detach a bipod. It's great. I will be doing a bipod video soon, so stay tuned for that. I'm going to get a little bit more into my suggestions, specifically Harris bipods, because I've been using them forever, and I really like them. They are quick to use. They're kind of the gold standard. Um, so I still run them, and again, I'll bring out a video on that in the future. Some tips and tricks on how to run them a little better, and uh, what size I recommend, because I use a few different ones and also which leg models I recommend and for what purpose. Cause again, they both have use case. Um, but I know they can be really confusing. So I'm gonna do a video specifically on Harris bipod soon. So that's something you want to see. Just let me know and I'll bump it up my priority list. I just want to do a quick video on this cause I'm loving it and I'm out here. So I figured I'd film it for you guys. ADM Harris to pick rail QD mount. Get one if you want to upgrade your Harris. All right, guys. So I appreciate you watching the video. I just want to bring this quick video to you guys, kind of showing this. I know I haven't been putting out a lot of content, trying to get back into the role of, uh, with that. And uh, this thing's awesome. So if you want to support us, please consider subscribing. Hit that like button. Share this with your friends. And uh, comment down below specifically what you want to see from me in the future. And uh, if you want to see a bipod video or anything like that, or if you have anything else that you want to see from me, gives me a little bit of inspiration to kind of push it forward to work on those videos because I know somebody's asking for it. So I appreciate that. And uh, if you want to support us in any other way, go over to the website, link down in the description and uh, 
check out our freedom slings that we make in-house, my wife and I, and our sling retention straps as well. Uh, very small business, American made right here in Pennsylvania. Just trying to, you know, do the things, make a living for ourselves out here and, uh, you know, all that good stuff. Anyway, I'm getting wordy. I appreciate you guys. Till next time, get out and train.